I'm with Pete Murphy. He's a legend at Cando FM. Hello, Pete. How are you? Yeah, I'm really good. How are you? I I'm doing all right. Um, you have a show every morning of the week. How did you get involved with that? Um, with Candu, um, I do the, the, the breakfast show, the, the Murph in the mornings at seven through until 10, uh, weekdays, Monday through until Friday. And, um, and for that, um, for, or for my sins, how they get involved in that? Um, I, I was just kind of uh, approached by Johnny, the, the now station manager, um, and, and asked from, uh, my background in, in, in radio, um, if I would help and, and sort of get involved and help to sort of maybe present the show um, and or uh, sort of help to train other people up and, and new people if we had any ideas for um, for how the station wanted to, to kind of move on and, 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 um, and, and grow. Um, and, and I had a background in commercial radio. Um, probably people will, will remember uh, many moons ago, Abbey FM, which was a commercial radio station in Barrow that run from 2006 to 2009, uh, those happy Abbey days, um, and um, with the legend that is Russell Dog Walker. Um, and, uh, and I had a show, I had a breakfast show on there, and I switched to mid-mornings with that. Um, and, and I was taught how to produce commercial radio. I think what was really lucky for me, at the time, I always said I would, I would rather be lucky than good. And um, mm -hmm. and I was just very very lucky to be the right guy in the right place at the right time. Uh, also with the show as well that uh, whatever my personality, whatever it is that's in me, uh, that sort of lust for life and always looking for a bit of a crack and always having fun and um, keeping myself kind of young. Uh, I know I look um, forty five, but still feeling like you. 21 inside you know it's it's that kind of whatever that is that's in me that seems to fit well with breakfast show and seems to fit well with with kind of um early mornings and as soon as i wake up in the morning my brain kicks in and and um and and, and away you go so the uh the breakfast show seemed the, the the uh the the right kind of vehicle for me and and obviously with my background at abby um i, I came involved with with candu um so that was when was that? Maybe eighteen months, maybe maybe two years ago now. Probably coming up to two years, I think, in in, in October. Um, and it's been great, you know. For me, I, I'm I'm very ordinary. I, I say this on air a little bit, and and um, I'm the original face for radio. Um, but I, I I'm Daniel's dad. I'm Millie's dad. I, I'm um, you know I, when, when I get a microphone in my hand, kind of sometimes extraordinary things happen. But in life in general, I'm just very ordinary um and uh, so it's nice for me as, a, as, a, as an ordinary kind of barrow island guy and the best type of barrow guy the barrow island guy um to just put a little bit back into the community and being able to kind of help and and, and promote things locally it's um it's just a, a a nice thing to do you know you say you're ordinary but you are part of two groups that receive love barrow awards and we know that can do fm got one of them yay thank you everyone um but you were part of another one as well. What was it? Yeah, the, the, so I'm a director at, at Battle Raiders. I've been a director now for, um, for about five years, something like that. And, and before that, I was a commercial manager down there uh, for about another three before that. So maybe eight, eight in total. Um, I was uh, in a voluntary role and, and, and completely unpaid uh, doing the kind of commercial side of things at, at, at Battle Raiders. Um, the... There's many sort of groups that, that are down there. There's a media group, which I'm involved with. There's the community group, which the media group kind of supports. Commercially, we, uh, in, in, in my role down there with Adele Neal, uh, who's a sensational commercial manager and, and revolutionised us down at, the, down at the rugby, along with um, Steve Neal, um, our new CEO and, 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 and chairman, um, that we set up with Dennis Fay and Shona Hartley, um, uh, Dennis Fay is another teaching legend in the in the town. Um, Shona used to be a professional footballer with Leeds, uh, Barra girl, mm -hmm. uh, went to Chetwind, uh, and we set up our community department uh, through sport, um, helping mm -hmm. to um, advantage children uh, and families uh, to get them out and and get kids off the Xbox and and all these sort of things. Uh, so the community uh, arm of of Barra Raiders. That won uh, a Love Barrow Award uh, again this year, so um, it's it's doubly nice to 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 be involved in both of them groups. You know, it's all about kind of for me, it's all about putting back into the community. 
I've had a very, very privileged and good living uh, that's been given to me by the people of Barrow, uh, people supporting me for years through my singing um, and coming to see me in pubs and gigs and stuff and for me to do weddings and, and functions. And I've been very lucky. Um, and so it's nice to just give a little bit back to that, you know. Um, we've got to wrap this up because uh, it's time to get back to the music. But uh, what I'd like to know is when can listeners hear you on Kando FM? So I'm on uh, for my sins, 7 through until 10, weekday mornings uh, with the Murph in the Morning Show. Uh, that's the, the, the breakfast show uh, here on Kando, uh, playing great music um, every morning. It's all about energy and the vibrancy. It's all about uh, playing the right songs to get, get people up. We, at the moment, we have our singing in the shower feature where we'll play an absolute classic, a barnstormer where people can sing along in the shower. Uh, we do that around about 20 to 8 and 20 to 9. Uh, there's also the celebrity birthdays um, and uh, and sometimes if there's time um, I'll squeeze in a little classic album of the week as well all that tied together with my banter a uh, bit of crack and, and generally on a Wednesday taking the mickey out of Tony Callister as well which is uh, which is great fun um, yeah, that's so a that, pastime that, that, I can do it's, it's, it's the best thing about the, the best thing about the week <laughs> is being able to chain Tony um, he, he takes it in good part and he gives a bit yeah. back he's a great uh, top guy uh, thank you so much Pete Thank you as well and, and continue on the great work you're doing. Super. Oh, Cheers, thank Mike. You.